a couple of runs here. Just look at that excellent drive. Definitely saved the boundary, and that's what wicket ki- wickets can do. You see, the Mirpur Royals were down and out, but Mohammad Taha this time lifting the team up with his fielding. And Ahmad Bhat, he, ha- he has been the man for Mirpur Royals who brought the team back. And now this man, Shahid Afridi, can he do what he's always known for? You can see the roar, you can hear the roar of the crowd. Everyone is so excited that he's he's playing this match, playing this league. What do you say? Mid-wicket, is it? In the air. He's hit it hard. The fielder's right there and won't get to it. Shahid Afridi welcomes Muzaffarabad with that big one. Living up to his expectations, this is what the crowd wants from him and this is what they get. Shahid Afridi, six of the very first delivery. Used the crease really well, moved to the offside, flicked it off his hips and it's off for the maximum. Excellent. When he hits it, they stay hit. Then he's hit the biggest sixes uh, all across the world, the grounds he's played on. You offer him pace and he loves that, man. That's what Samin Gul did. Had good bounce for it. He'd already shuffled across, if you noticed. He got himself into a good position to play that behind the square on the onside. So he's shuffled across, played across the line, hit for a six, and now he's asking his partner what, what is happening with the pitch or the bowler. That's Shahid Afridi for you. Yeah, here we are. You, know, you can log on to the PSO Facebook page, fb.com slash PSOCL, and you can win yourself gift hampers. So don't wait, hurry, and log on to their Facebook page, fb.com slash PSOCL. It has not been Samin's goal day so far. Let's see if he can change that. And he's uh, hit that one behind the point this time around he was again shuffling across but it was bowled wide just opening the face he's got enough power on it and hitting it to extremes of the ground first six over square leg and this time through the point region Shahid Afridi making use of the goal ground the pitch just look how deep he went into the crease and just used the bounce and pace over that point point fielder for four runs for six runs Still got that eye. Loves facing fast bowlers. Pressures on Samin Gul. What is the ball next? It's just pretty much spread out field on the onside. Just one man in the circle. But once it hits that bat of Shahid Afridi, you don't really bother about how many are near the ropes. Samin Gul. Hits it straight, hits it hard. No one to stop that one. That's the third big score in the over. Pressure's on. And this is what experience can do. He's making the bowler ball in the region he wants to hit. Uses the crease this time down the wicket. Comes down the wicket. He knew he would bowl full because he has got two boundaries of the back foot. And this time coming out of the crease. He was going deep in the crease before. Now coming down the wicket and hitting it straight. No chance for the bowler. It's just so amazing to see this. This is the T20 roar that we've been missing for a couple of years now. Where Shahid Afridi is facing, he hits big shots. And the sound in the ground is just deafening. Though we don't have a full house, but it's just so loud here. Shahid Afridi easily going at 533.33 strike rate. (laughs) He's already 16 of three deliveries. A couple of changes in the field. He's already made up his mind. He's just eyeing which area should I go for now. It was one uh, behind the square on the onside, then just around point, then a straight hit, and he's earned himself 16 of three. Practice a late cut in on this delivery. Let's see what he has to offer. Yeah, that works. Base off works. Yes. That should have been the choice earlier on. End of the over, 17 gone, 169 for four. They've been put into bat, don't forget that. 
making full use of it. What a great start that was from uh, Rav Lakot Hawks with the openers. Got to replicate that Shoaib Malik when he comes out with the bat. Salman Irshad back onto the bowling. He just comes on strike and you, you hear the crowd just roaring. Good start of the over. New Yorker lane. Let's have a look at that. Just back of the hand. Oh, that's the previous over's last ball from Samin Gul. It was a very good slow one and also well directed. It is it was within Shahid Afridi's body. He wanted to play it to the third man region, but because it was too within the body, he was not able to glide it to the third. That was a good ball. I mean, he played a gamble there. He could have ended up with a low full toss as well. He had to take the pace off. Because you, you can actually see that Shahid Afridi has made up his mind. He's going to go after you. That's the mind he has made up for 20 years ago, I think. <laughs> yeah, so now what you're going to do is just make him rethink about his plans by taking pace off. It's not that small a ground. He'll probably sky one. Here we go. Oh, he's missed the full toss completely. You can see the gesture. He says just lost the ball somewhere. And Salman Irshad getting the big man on his home home city. He's from Kashmir, Salman Irshad, and getting the big wicket of Afridi. How big this moment is for him. Yeah, the moment the ball hit the stumps, it was Shahid Afridi. Just making a gesture. He lost it somewhere. It's full toss. And he just hears the sound when the ball hits the stumps. He's like, no way. I didn't see that at all. He was set up because the square leg fielder was inside the circle and Afridi tried to hit it too square, missed it completely. Afridi gone for a cameo, 16 runs, Hawks 170 for 5. 